What's going on, RBG fam, bam? My name is Robert, aka ODM. I'm Vanessa, aka Dahina. I'm Elijah. Hey! <laughs> and we are the RBG fam. Yes, so we know how important it is these days to wear a mask when we're out in public. But it's so difficult to find the right mask, the one that fits, the one that doesn't fall off. And can you imagine trying to find one for your child? Oh. Elijah, show them who's here to save the day. Hey! It's Crayola Spoon Mask Pack. So right away, you guys, it comes with this cool washable mesh bag right here. You just put your mask in, zip it up, and throw it in the washer. Oh yeah. <laughs> so each school mask pack comes with five comfortable cloth masks, as you see right here. On each mask, we have the little Crayola designs, and it has these adjustable straps right here so it can fit your child perfect. Uh, this one right here is orange. What color is this? Red. We also have green, in case Elijah is wearing green one day. Also yellow, and then the orange like I was holding. So basically, you have a mask for every single day of the week. Along with these adjustable straps right here to fit your child's ear, they also come with a wire on top to bridge over the nose so that it's not like open, so you know, anything can get in, into their nose, into their mouth, so it'll fit them nice and snug. It also has like a little name tag, it says name, and you can put your child's name right here. Give him a little shake, Elijah. <laughs> now let's see if we can hear what he's saying. Elijah, what does C stand for? Crayola. Crayola. <laughs> And not only that, you guys, Crayola Mask Pack will donate a portion of your purchase to a charity of your choice. And to tell you the truth, school masks work better than any other mask we've ever tried. Yeah, and you know what? They also sell these little straps that you can buy so your kid can wrap them, you know, around their neck and they can hang. Because I know little kids like our son, they're always dropping it, they're always putting it on the table, maybe on the surface that's not really clean, or even dropping them on the floor. And for a limited time only, get 15% off your school mask pack order by visiting schoolmaskpack.com forward slash RVG and use the promo code RVG. And that's 15% off any order, you guys. Thank you Crayola Mask Pack for sponsoring today's video. You thought it was the new intro, huh? <laughs> we gotta be kind of quiet because she's like, uh, it's kind of hard to be quiet because, I you know, know. It's okay. Because we got, we got, we got to be like hyped today because this is our intro right now. It's what you've been waiting for this whole time. But our baby still sleeps, so we got to kind of, you know. Just a little, just a little. Just a little bit. In fact, she's sleeping throughout this whole vlog. No, <laughs> she's up actually. If you know, she sleeps when she wants to sleep. She true, true that. But for the most part, she's right there. Oh, mommy. If you're new to this channel, please hit that subscribe button and turn on those post notifications so you get notified every time we upload a brand new video. Oh, we are so excited to get into this vlog. I know it's been long awaited. You came for the intro, didn't you? Oh, <laughs> yeah. I I'm know. Excited. And we are too. We are too. We're coming off of the. Uh, you know, the, the debut of my music video for A Newborn Miracle. If you missed that, it's right here in the corner. Check that out. Um, other than that, though, we got to drop it on them, babe. We got to drop another one on them. Another one. <laughs> another one. An intro. So we'll get into that later on in this video. We got to ask you, don't be scrolling. Don't be scrolling. Yeah, it might be hidden in the middle. So, you know, you can't scroll. You just got to keep watching. Either way, I mean, our vlogs... And it's gonna be mainly in the high night this vlog because I think I was out and about or something. I was at work, huh? Yeah, you were busy working when I was vlogging for this day, so yeah. So it's a day just in the life routine. Kinda, yeah, just a little taste of what my mornings have been like. And they've gotten, I think, crazier in the last two days just because Layla's had more homework. So I'm like trying to feed her, trying to do homework with Layla. And on the other side, you know, I have Elijah who wants my attention too, so. We're just all three, literally all three on this couch. Like, I'm like, I just want my life back. Just kidding. I love it's kids. all about juggling, being a parent, mm -hmm. man. I give you props, though. Yeah. Um, but I want to go back real quick to um, Saturday because my boy, Concrete, was here and he brought his boys down. And we were supposed yeah. to work, right? But you can't work when those kids are around, like I said. And uh, this is the some, some video footage. And he's actually the guy that shot the intro as well. And your music video. And the music video as well. Shout outs to Concrete. Link is in the description. R2 Films. That's his company. Let's go. Oh, what's going on over here? Mommy taking a bath. Oh, good morning, Mika. Huh? You taking 
Yeah, nice bath. That's not mine, FYI, you guys. Yeah. I'm, I'm not drinking and giving my baby a bath. <laughs> oh, that's mine, that's mine. We shared his and hers bathroom, see? Yeah. Even though it's on her side. Uh, yeah. Mommy, you can't eat that. Hi, Mama, say hi, Bam Bam. Look at her. Boy, look at you, my baby. Sing it, Delilah. Sing it, Uncle. Say one look into my baby's eyes, got me <laughs> feeling so hip. Okay, she knows it. You like the song, huh? Mm -hmm. What's your favorite part? What? Look at her big, beautiful eyes. I, I love, love her, her eyes. Her eyes. Her eyes are so pretty, Mama. Come here. I got your eyes. <gasps> oh my. Ooh. Okay, God. here you go, I'm back. <laughs> so you're weird, Uncle. You wanna call me uncle or call me Nino? Cause I'm your Nino and I'm your uncle. What do you wanna call me? Always. 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 <laughs> she always calls me Gunkle. Gunkle. Hi mommy. Hi mommy. Hi mama. Oh, she looked at the camera. You're such a little star, she aren't you? Already, huh? You're such a little star. So, um, Concrete just got here right now with his boys. Mm -hmm. So we're gonna be out in the back. And guys, we got family coming over. You know what it is. Saturday fun day. Just the immediate family. Gonna do some swimming and hopefully we get the Heine to come downstairs because she be like anti-social sometimes. No, I'm not. I'm bonding with my baby. That's true. I just say that because I miss her. I know. I miss you too, baby. Okay. What's going on down here? What's going on, man? Okay. Who's in the house? Yo, what's up? It's your boy Concrete. <laughs> With little the feet, medium the feet. Or... <laughs> <laughs> Let me see. Go down the slide. Yo, what's up, guys? No. Hey, what's up, Caleb? What's, what's up, though? Say what's up, ODM. Yeah, what? <laughs> I got a train. Well, one. <laughs> All right, let's get it, Pop. Okay, backwards, all uh, flex. All right, that's what we're doing today. We're doing some boil. We got some drumsticks. Also, we got some hamburgers. You know what I'm hey. saying? We're doing America, America barbecue right now. We're doing America. We got the weenies coming in. Right we got now. the weenies? The weenies coming in right now. Hot dogs, Dodger dogs. <laughs> Dodger dog, chili dog? Chili dogs. Oh, chili and weenies in the same sense, bro. I don't chili, know. chili, weenies. We got the boys over there making noise. Hey. It's daddy and boy. It seems like it's a daddy and boy day today, yeah, man. It kind of is, man. It kind of is. Where Look at them. Where the moms at, though, bro? Chilling, just... chilling, taking time off with the babies. Yeah, it's man. all right. Hey, you know what's crazy is that bad, dude just I just had a baby three a month ago. He was at one two weeks ago. Two weeks ago, he got a four year old. Here's Come his four year old. What's up, dude? My four year old's yeah, over there. Go, go get in here. And um. We're making babies and we're making great content. Malachi, what's up? Caleb, Caleb, Caleb. Hey, okay. I think all of my kids are upstairs sleeping. Well, actually, Layla probably is about to go on her Zoom, but Amaya and Elijah are still sleeping. And it's crazy, you guys. Tonight, our last night, was the first night that Amaya only woke up one time. She's still sleeping right now. It's 7.40. And I almost kind of want to like wake her up because I feel like it's like too long. When I was talking to my doctor the other day, he said she's already one month. She can obviously start sleeping a little bit longer. But I'm like, oh my God, do I need to wake her up every three hours and feed her? Do I need to wake her up every four hours and feed her? Um, but anyway, so she went to bed around 9.30, woke up. Actually, she didn't even wake up last night. I had to wake her up in the middle of the night because... My boobs were killing me. They hurt so freaking bad, so I had to wake her up so she can nurse. I think I woke her up around 2.30. So she slept from 9.30 to 2.30. Woke her up, she went back to bed at 3.30. And then I woke up again at 6.30 because my boobs were killing me again. I'm like, crap, should I wake her up? Should I let her sleep? I don't know, what do we do? So I ended up letting her sleep. I ended up coming downstairs and pumping for a little bit. I'm just gonna let her sleep a little bit. It actually is giving me time to do stuff. Make some coffee, I took a shower, I put some brand new cute earrings in, and I think I'm gonna try to get ready right now as far as like my makeup. It's been really, really hard to get ready, especially in the morning. Morning to like early afternoon, she just really wants to be up. She wants to hang out for a little bit, then she wants to nurse, she wants to hang out, then she wants to nurse, and it's really hard for me to get anything done until 
2, 3 in the afternoon is when she takes like her long stretch of a nap and then I'm able to get ready. But it's like, why do I want to get ready? And it's like almost going to be time for bed for me. So if you guys want like a um, postpartum video, let me know down below. I was thinking of doing one for you guys. I honestly just haven't had time to do one yet as far as um, how everything went when I came home. Did I deal with postpartum depression as far as nursing, milk, sleeping for the baby, all that good stuff. I was thinking of putting that in a video for you guys, so let me know down below if you guys want to see that. I am going to attempt to do my makeup right now, see how long she will sleep for, and um, I might just have one eyebrow done. I don't know these days, so we will see. There's little mommy's right here sleeping in her bassinet. All right, you guys, so this is like a really weird and bad angle, but I've been having to get ready in the downstairs restroom because I don't want to wake up the baby when she is sleeping. I could get ready in Lila's bathroom, but I just chose to be downstairs just to kind of get out of the upstairs environment. So I'm going to try to get ready real quick, guys. <laughs> All right, so I managed to get both eyebrows on, but they just need to be cleaned up a little bit. Also, I forgot to mention at the beginning of this vlog that you guys are only here to see the intro, right? So you guys obviously know um, an intro has been a long awaited and we obviously have a new baby girl. So stay tuned, you guys. Don't try to go fast forward because I promise you guys it will be in this vlog. You just have to be patient, okay? And you guys will see the intro very, very soon. All right, guys, so I did manage to get bold eyebrows on, and she's still sleeping. She's squirming around a little bit. I'm going to try to do my foundation real quick, and um, I think I might just go wake her up to feed her. So let me just get this done, and then we'll go see if she's ready to eat. My face has been so freaking bad lately. I put this mask on. Was it last night or the night before last night? It made my skin so, like, red and blotchy. I was so mad. So I had all this like redness here and here and like by my nose and stuff. I don't know if it was like supposed to do that, but it looked really, really bad. And it it like made my pimples come out like even more. But I don't know. Is that what masks are supposed to do? Like just really clean out your skin? I feel like it is, huh? I don't use anything like super fancy for my foundation, you guys. I have this Neutrogena Healthy Skin Liquid Makeup. I used the honey like in the summer because I was really tanned and I noticed that I'm not that tan anymore. So I'm like, I really like this foundation because I don't like matte foundation. I think it makes my face look really like dry and like cakey. I like like a liquid foundation that's gonna give me more of like a dewy look. I always preferred like the dewy look instead of like a matte dry look since the honey was like really like looking too dark i went and got fresh beige and i realized later i don't like anything with beige in it because i don't have that like beigey skin tone i have more of like a yellow type skin tone so now i'm having to mix it in with honey i think it mixes pretty well and they love it because it's so like liquidy it's not dry and like matte. And I think my eyebrows are not twins today. They're like best friends and they don't match. <laughs> but that's what happens when you're in a hurry. All right, fam bam. So I literally had the perfect amount of time to finish my makeup. This is my just everyday look, you guys. It's nothing crazy. This is what I do when I do a get ready. Um, if you can hear, baby girl just got up. Little mommies. I'm coming, my love. All right, let's go get her. Okay, mommy, get you ready. Did you have a good sleep, my love? Yeah. <laughs> Look at that hair, though. I woke up like this. Oh, I just want to squeeze this face. I just want to squeeze it, mommies. I love you. Oh my god, you guys. I just love this little face. That was her sound machine making that noise right there. Look at you. What is this? What is this big fluff thing in your face? I think she sees the mic, you guys. It's like a movie. Hi, my love. 
Was it just camera in your face, mummies? Ooh, you're being such a good girl. All right, guys, I'm gonna get her, change her. Oh, I see her. She's so precious, I love her. And look who just got up with your little morning eyes and that morning brew. <laughs> It's baby. You love her? Yeah. You slept a long time, just like your baby sister. <laughs> you guys both slept a long time. <laughs> I guess still gotta make my bed, guys. No you judge me. Kitty, kitty, kitty. Oh. There's baby girl. She oh. just ate. She's nice and full. I want eat waffles. Waffles? I love waffles. The pancake. Waffles or pancakes, or pancakes and waffles? Not pancakes, no. but waffles. Waffles, all oh, right, you got it, dude. You got it. You got it, dude, you got it, dude. Ooh, la la. Shalai, oh, ho, ho. Elijah, can you do a C for me? C says, cut, 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 car. Good job! You are so, so smart. Boy, Yesterday, the t uh, Robert picked him up from school, guys, and the teacher said he did a presentation, which was probably that, and he did such a good job, she said. Oh, yeah! And my grab I saw them, so I got them from the store, not hurt my hands. How are you going to be, mommies? Are you going to be... The talkative one? Or are you gonna be the shy girl? Damn girl, you need to blend in your uh, bronzer there. I was actually really, really shy when I was younger. Um, more like child years. As I got older, I did learn to speak up. I was obviously a cheerleader in high school, so I couldn't be shy then. But I think as I became an adult, I learned to definitely um, speak up and stand up for myself. Yeah, I think it comes with age sometimes, but I was really, really shy when I was a kid, like super shy. My example or an example that my parents would use is we would go to Round Table Pizza every Friday night as a family. And my dad would be like, Vanessa, go ask for a box to take the leftover pizza home. And I couldn't even go ask for a to-go box because I was so shy. So I would make my little sister who's five years younger than me go and ask because she wasn't the shy one. <laughs> so yeah, I was super shy when I was little. And just like that, that's the end of the vlog right there. We try to make it extra long for you today because mm -hmm. we've been backed up. It's been a crazy week. And I know it seems like, uh, I don't know if it seemed like to you, but like the video was kind of like all over the place or, you know. Yeah. Um, but, you know, we've been through a lot and we wanted the new music video to go ahead and just set with you guys for at least a couple days before we drop mm -hmm. the new vlog because um, that's very important but thank you so much again for your support now on to the intro you ready man? i'm ready i feel like um let's talk about it first okay what is what is our our theme what did what did we try to go with or should we talk about it after <sighs> no let's let them wa let them watch it did you guys watch it and then we'll kind of tell you our thoughts and theme and stuff what we were going for for this intro. Yeah, okay. collectively with our boy Concrete because he actually came up with the idea. Yeah. So, y'all ready? <laughs> I'm nervous. Three, two, two. one. <laughs> Just another sunny day in California. It's just another sunny day and we in the Golden State. And you know it just don't stop. As we start from the back to the block, it's just another sunny day. There it is, fam, fam. Woohoo! Look at, look at, we got little mama in there now. She's 
I she's know. In the intro. Her part is like the best part. I think it's so cute. But honestly, I'm so impressed with Layla. She was so cute. Yeah, like, Layla knocked it out. They all did. Like, like in no time, and I'm very impressed and very proud. So. I know, cause you know, like Elijah, I love his part, but you guys already know Elijah's like that. Uh -huh. But Layla, she was just, she's just so beautiful, and her hair was so long and. She did such a good job. All three of them did great, great yeah. smiles, man. I loved it so much. So, I mean, what'd you guys think? Leave your comment below and tell us what you think about it. You know, uh, how different was it from our last video? Well, mm -hmm. besides the fact it was two years ago. Yeah. And we know you really wanted it. And we wanted to give you give you one as well, too. Plus, the Haina, she was wearing black hair. And now she's got light hair. Mm -hmm. Trust me, I wanted to wait, you guys. But... By the time I was like actually ready, by the time we were gonna be able to plan a date, and you know, I wanted to lose more weight. That was literally a week after I had the baby, so I was still, you know, really swollen and stuff, but I was like, you know what, let's just do it. Let's just knock it out. I'm ready today, you know, mm -hmm. for the music video, I had to get ready, so. Mm -hmm. We just went ahead and did it, yeah. and I think it came out great. And yeah. uh, oh, shout out to Concrete, man. Yeah, so he had this type of, what type of theme, or like, what was he trying to go with? It was like, when he first approached me, he said more like a Simpsons type sitcom mm -hmm. type. So that's what you see all the little cartoon like stars and the yeah. in and out and the flash and just sitcom -y. So, you yeah, know, like a TV show, you know? Right. So you, you, you put us in that element, and I think you did a great job. Yeah, I like that too, because I I think that you guys like to watch us almost like a TV show, maybe. You know? <laughs> so the intro is very relatable to like a show you would watch on TV, so I like it. And one thing he said, like, I wanted to end with you guys all on the couch. Like, everybody's doing their thing. If you mm -hmm. notice, I was barbecuing. The wife was... Um, with the baby, like With I the been. baby, like she is now. <laughs> Layla getting ready for school, mm -hmm. whatever. Put on lip gloss. Liza playing in his room. Yes. But then at the end, to all come together on the couch like hurry up hurry up it's gonna start the vlog that is and we all end up on the couch together kind of like the simpsons yeah i like it i definitely like it a lot and um that's gonna be with us for the next couple months we're hoping obviously to do a christmas intro and then we're debating in january if we're gonna do a whole new intro which i think i want to because by then i should probably you know be back to normal my body the baby's gonna be a little bit bigger yep. and uh, it's gonna be a new year and we're gonna be done with 2020 because i bet everybody wants to be done with this year <laughs> So get ready for it. All of that. <laughs> Lots to come. And we got to give our post notification shout out. We're going to play the uh, video again. But before we do, shout outs to Marquez. Hey. hey. Shout out to you. Thank you so much for watching our channel. We love you for that. If you guys would like a post notification shout out, all you guys got to do is one, subscribe to our YouTube channel. Two, hit the little bell button so that every time we post, you guys will get notified. And when you're done, just comment down below. Hashtag done. Thank you again, once again, for watching. Here we go, RVG Fam 2020. New intro with Baby Amaya. I'm saying.